so so guys the um, the rant for today is going to be about uh, tea tea and horses i will make an analogy that will explain very well you know uh, why people behave the sheep especially behave the way they do uh, so here i am like uh, more than a thousand meters high and there is a particular uh, kind of tea that you can see everywhere here because it's the right spot where this tea can grow as for example in this place in this prateria uh, uh, how do you say you know in this uh, field here only certain kinds of bushes uh, can grow because it's the objective perfect soil water humidity temperature for this kind of plant here and that's why you can not see another kind of plant here so as for this kind of tea that grows here and this kind of plant that only grows here there is an objective way a good way because i'm trying to to explain you know uh, the ob the objectivity of good and bad for example what i'm trying to say is as for this plant there is a good way and there is a bad way the good way for this plant is this temperature this place this kind of soil which uh, this plant can find only here if i put this plant in rome it will die if i take the tea that is here a thousand meters high in rome it will not grow it's not uh, objectively the good way now as for these plants there is an objective way to grow this plant and for for humans also there is an objective way uh, to make humans to 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 live a, a, a good life the problem is this so the problem is humans are of two kinds just like horses guys there is the captured horse you know and there is the wild horse which is free now what is objectively good for the free horse it's not objectively good for the slave horse you know which has been used by the man so that's why we can't convince the sheep guys because they are the dumb used animals and sort of noise and and they are right the objective way for the horses that is captured for a captured horse is the way they live guys they are slaves and that's the the objective way to live their lives we on the other hand we are free we like to be free not to be controlled like like dummies like them so that's why for us the objective good and bad is different from the objective good and bad of the slaves guys of people that are taken care of by the system at the point of uh, you know of extreme you know point so what i'm trying to say we are two species here guys the few one that wants to live free and the rest of the dummies that are switch off the brain and want to be served by the system and the system serves them from their backs very good that's it man Guys, talking about horses, here is a wild horse. They're free. But they are afraid of man, of me. They are looking at me. They are not used to man, they are free. Now, of course, this is another kind of beast. It doesn't run from me. It's a slave. You know, it doesn't run away. So guys, uh, this is um, the usual whatever town, you know, here in Italy, guys. A, uh, a town, a small town in, uh, in, the, in the mountains. So it's mostly abandoned. Uh, there are people, though. Uh, for example, we can see there is a cat there that I will scare right now. Oh, there are two cats. 
I hope I will not scare them. Oh, three cats, bro. Three cats. They are cool. Yeah. And so, you know, um, the problem is this, guys. There are lots of places that are closed and abandoned that uh, can uh, can have the, the insects inside them and the spiders warm, you know. But me, a human being that... Uh, that is, is uh, you know something more something more um, than uh, an animal uh, will have to to use a tent to sleep here so nobody's helping here guys uh, the only guy that uh, somehow uh, look at the wood here guys uh, you know I really like this place man it's it's beautiful you know but the problem guys is there is no uh, community anymore guys these people, um, not only here, but everywhere, here in Italy and all around the world, do not trust each other. And when we do not trust each other, I mean, we are done, guys. So these are all abandoned buildings, guys. These are people that have bought these houses, but, and they let them close like this. Nobody comes here, you know. You would see, for example, uh, some, someone living here. But uh, but they come just for for holidays, for example, yeah. And so this is what you get. It's all abandoned. This this building, for example, it's uh, they are restructuring. This other one, maybe someone lives here, but m most of them are all closed, as you can see down there. So let's see what happens now, guys, because uh, there is this guy that uh, where I, where I bought something to eat uh, before. He told me that uh, if you don't find anything, I can uh, let you sleep at my uh, lawn. <laughs> Imagine that, guys. P -p People are nasty, guys. We don't trust each other. And I'm not saying that I, I would uh, uh, <laughs> I would be someone, you know, that if I if I see some uh, someone that I don't know, you know, a dick like this with the woods. <laughs> that I never met in my life, you know, that I will invite him and everything, you know. I don't know. I don't know if if I will do it. I, uh, something in uh, in me uh, tells me that uh, I will never let someone, you know, just sleep outside when I have the space and everything. Something tells me that I would never do that. So all these kids that you see here, guys, are are playing soccer or whatever, and they are are this or. Uh, all people that have come from uh, Rome into into these uh, towns, you know, small towns, and enjoy themselves, and uh, they leave soon. So they come here, drink and eat uh, toxic shit, you know. They play soccer here you know, for free, and then they go and put the the mask. They are they are ready, ripe for uh, for you know. To be killed, guys. There is these people are dumb, guys. I was seeing, you know, in in this uh, 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 playground for kids, uh, a, a mother with with um, disinfectant, with a mask, of course, washing uh, washing the 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 thing, you know, where the kid sits. Unbelievable, guys. I, I was just almost going there to spit in her face, but you know. I know these people are bad, brain dead, so you would do not, it's like, you know, kicking a rock. It's... So guys, this is the baby. It's, it's like a, a sarcophagus. You know? uh, your head is here, you know? and, uh, and it's just the, the essential, you know, it's just high enough so that you don't have it in your, in your face, you know, so you have room for your head here. You can also open the net here and, and so the air flows and behind it's made like this there is air flowing down there also and uh, and here you know you you put your feet and uh, and it stands like this so it has this uh, spikes that you put like this you know just two things like this you know the band two sticks like this and it's done. It's very simple. Uh, and so inside, I will, I will put the. Um, although this is uh, this is good when you are in this uh, ground, you know, uh, it's it's already softer than uh, you know, let's say, uh, 
when I sleep, for example, in uh, in um, inside, you know, and you know something rough like uh, hard wood or concrete, whatever. You know. So, but uh, you know, I put the tarp here, so it, give, it gives extra softness, and then I will put the, of course, this that has already a little bit of adds a little bit of softness. So this is the place where I'll sleep, guys. Uh, um, the guy, you know. Um, so this guy uh, had uh, lots of rooms there, guys, but they were all for sale, for for sale, for sale, sale. You know, it's a bed and breakfast, guys. So, and um, the human being, uh, if he doesn't pay, uh, of course, he he will stay outside. But but no, I'm I'm not uh, I'm not com complaining at all at all because I, I don't want really I don't want to. Uh, spend uh, electricity uh, really i really don't don't want to do that but you know the problem is that uh, right now you know the the sheep will have so much that they could share but you know i have the water here as you can see this is the the luxury so this guy is like the vice uh, mayor of, of this town so you know all the key Reptilians guys are in the key position, you know, and they run everything in our system But you know since they have so much, you know, this guy had a business there where he sold me food a bar uh, Then he has the bed and breakfast here Rooms all, all over in this villa. I don't want to, to show it right now uh, I don't know what, what I was saying man, so this is that, that's it man. These are the reptilian running our world and uh, soon, the, the better the better reptilians uh, out, out, out the controlling this little fish also, this little reptilian will uh, make them erase, make them go away, because the system uh, must be uh, of uh, of slavery. We will go back in slavery, guys. Devolution. Uh, let's hope it doesn't rain. Uh, and. I was thinking, you know, since it might rain, it's better to put the tent over over the tent, you know? the tarp over the tent. You know, the tarp is that flat thing, you know, which I could hang somehow. I have also the sticks here. You know? So that's it, guys. Uh, I will survive this also. But you know, for me, it's funny uh, to see, you know, to see Italians, guys, that have everything. Look at this place, guys. And I don't want to show his villa, guys. He, he has bed and breakfast, lots of rooms there. But uh, he, he doesn't have, not even the... Um, because he is ashamed of himself, you know. Because we are built, you know, to know deep inside us. We know when we are doing good or evil. So this guy told me right now. Okay, um, so you have a tent, so sleep outside. Uh, my rooms are, are all uh, prenotate, like uh, they are busy. Uh, people have... I mean, people does, doesn't travel now. It, it, the rooms are empty, guys. There's nobody there. But, but they, are, they are shameless, guys. Shameless. These are the reptilians, guys. The reptilians have no shame. I, I mean, it, it would be so much uh, better to, to just tell me, you know, you don't want to pay, you don't have to pay, oh, you, you sleep in, uh, in the tent. Uh, that would, would be for me much better than, than telling me, you know, that the rooms are all occupied, you know. Come on, fucking reptilians. So me and my professional tent here, <laughs> it's sarcophagus. Salute you guys. See you on the next one. So, you know, guys, this is the view from the... <laughs> it, it, it's, it's barely, you know, necessary to, to just keep you, you know, alive somehow. So you have room just like for four fingers you know uh, upside and there's this uh, kind of uh, uh, how do you say pocket where you can put your phone or some thing or a book or whatever books what is a book <laughs> so this is a net guys and I, and I see mosquitoes coming near here because they feel me then they cannot get me <laughs> so uh, you know guys when you are uh, as them, as the sheeple, you know. Uh, for example, I could be a resource, 
uh, by talking with me, uh, people, you know, should we, we learn from each other, you know. But uh, when we are cogging a machine, when, when we are working as slaves, we do not need to, to hear the story of the other person. Because it's not necessary. You just need to know how to be a cog in a machine, how to be a slave, a good slave. Sucking dicks, you know, at the, at the more most powerful. That's all you need to do. And so, my story, who cares? I tell him, I tell to the Shiva, for example, the virus doesn't exist. They don't care. They just need to know what they have to do to keep their business, put the mask on, put the disinfectant, and do all that craziness. They will do it. They don't care for the truth, guys. The truth is not for them. Unfortunately. They will die slaves. So, sorry for the continuous rant, guys. See you tomorrow.